हेलो एवरीबॉडी वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल इन आवर प्रीवियस ट्यूटोरियल वी हैव लर्न टू मेक कूल एज इफेक्ट इन फोटोशॉप एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू दैट हाउ कैन वी मेक अ ग्रेडियन एंड यूज इट सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम गोइंग टू मेक अ न्यू डॉक्यूमेंट बाई क्लिकिंग फाइल एंड चूजिंग न्यू एंड आई हैव वेट ऑफ नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी एंड हाइट ऑफ टेन एटी विथ हंड्रेड पिक्सल रेजोल्यूशन क्लिक ओके टू मेक अ न्यू डॉक्यूमेंट एंड नाउ डबल क्लिक ऑन द लॉक आइकन टू अनलॉक दिस लेयर एंड आफ्टर दिस प्रेस जी और क्लिक हेयर एंड चूज दिस क्रीडिंग टूल एंड देन क्लिक एनी वेयर एंड ड्रेक टूवर्ड्स डाउन साइड to apply your gradient like this you can choose any style which you want to apply you can also apply from down to upward or upward to downward hold down shift key to just make a straight and you can also cho choose from these styles of gradients like if i choose this one now you can see that it's radial gradient and you can also apply like this you can also choose this one and also this one to make a diamond effect and if you want to choose the colors of this gradient just click here and here are many gradients by default you will not have uh, such kind of more gradients i have installed some third party gradients so after choosing any gradient like if i choose this one and i can choose the colors if i want to replace this red color just click this here and choose the color from here which you want to apply you can see that my color has been changed like similarly you can also click change the color of this green first of all click here and then choose and then click here to replace the color and you can also add uh, multiple colors just click here and when you click here it will add more this kind of points and you can choose any color by clicking and choosing here and if you want to delete any color just click on the this icon color icon and drag towards down side to delete the same and to add just click single click and click here and then choose your desired color to apply and now when i apply you can see that i have these colors which i have chosen okay you can also decrease the opacity you can also the if, uh, reverse the effect like in this gradient we have first green and then pink and then blue purple and blue color if i want to reverse this color you can choose this option and now when i apply you can see that our color has been reversed similarly you can decrease the opacity like this to see the effect of it as i am going to apply this on new layer and i am hiding this one and now when i apply you can see that it is uh, opacity due to its, its lower opacity it is not it is showing the 
transparent area so if I want to apply again by choosing 100% opacity and now you can see that we are no more seeing transparent area as the as the opacity is 100% okay this uh, this is this was the first method of applying gradient and now I'm going to show you second method and for that I'm going to delete this one and also this one and I'm going to getting a new layer and I'm going to also delete this one and I am filling the ground color this white color in my layer by clicking by hold down control and delete key pressing delete key and now if I want to let's say uh, fill a gradient in this shape so if I try to up gradient you can see that if I want to apply gradient on this from here you can see that I am not able to apply it is showing that could not use the gradient tool because the content of the layer is not directly editable so to apply gradient in these kind of shapes let's try to another method which is here uh, click on layer style this on fx icon and choose gradient overlay now you can see that we have applied the gradient default gradient which is black and white if you want to choose the gradient color inside this part you just click here and now you can see that the same gradient editor is appeared choose any one which you want to use and you can add multiple colors and you can choose you can see that you can replace any color like this and choose ok now you can also make some adjustment using these options like this you can scale scale the gradient like this and you can also reverse the effect like this and you can decrease the opacity like this you can also change the blending mode to see the if different styles yes you can see the styles are changing as I am changing blending modes like this like this you can see now I am going to choose the default option which is normal so in this way you can apply gradient in the shapes also and you can also apply the gradient in text like if I if I want to apply a gradient in my text uh, press T to choose the text tool and click any anywhere and start typing I am typing gradient and double click to select and click and drag here to increase the size of my text and now if I want to uh, apply the gradient in this text I'm there are two methods to apply gradient in the text first one is here uh, adjustment through adjustment layer 
I am going to click in this icon on this icon and choosing gradient tool. Now you can see that the gradient effect is applying on the whole. So if I want to apply the effect of this gradient on the text, hold down the alt key and put the mouse between text and gradient layer and click and now you can see that I have applied the text effect gradient effect in my text only. You can see that if I move my text there is the effect of gradient. Let me choose another gradient to see visible it correctly like this. You can see that I have applied a gradient in the text using uh, adjustment layer of gradient but in this there is a problem whenever I choose my text by pressing ctrl T and uh, and move the my text you can see that its gradient is also disturbing so if I want you can see that if I want to to gradient remain same it is not possible you can see that in adjustment layer if i am moving text the gradient is also changing so if i don't want to do this then the the same method then we use the same method of as we applied on the bird like if i want i am going to delete this one and this one and now I am pressing again T to select the text tool and click and now I am typing food and now if I want to apply gradient tool in this and this is in this uh, so I am going to again this blending this options FX click here on FX and choose gradient overlay and click here to again choose the gradient of your choice you can make changes any any changes which you want like this if you want to choose the color change colors like this choose ok and ok and now you can see that when if I am when I am Moving my text, there is no effect in my gradient. So according to my personal personal opinion, the applying to applying gradient from here is most uh, comfortable and a best way is compared to apply from here or from using adjustment gradient layer okay and now I'm going to make a new layer by clicking here and I'm making a square I'm going to press alt delete key to fill foreground color in this rectangle and press ctrl D to deselect and now I'm again going to apply uh, gradient from here on this rectangle I'm going to choose uh, gradient overlay and now I'm going to apply a stroke to see the or area of the uh, clearly and now I'm choosing gradient overlay and now I can apply any changes and if here are some styles which were appear here in our first method of gradients same are available here you can ch make changes using these options like this and you can choose angle you can choose reflected and choose diamond and you can resize 
like this and you can also choose the reverse the same all same options are available here and you can also change the angle of this choose linear okay and if you want to make any changes in like in this in the gradient of this bird just go to its layer and click on gradient overlay double click on gradient overlay and here is the options again you can choose any other color any adjustment if i want to change this I can do it easily like this so you can do each and everything which you want easily like this it's up to you what are you want to make and what you like so choose ok so that was a tutorial please subscribe to my channel to remain updated with my upcoming videos and if you have any question or feedback please ask and provide your feedback by commenting below Thank you for watching, take care and bye bye.